yet more transfer activity. It's been a busy week, this one, hasn't it? Um, first of all, I do apologise. There's building work going on outside, so there will be some noise. But Harry Wood has joined Shelburne on loan. Um, there was a little bit of talk about this because him and Harry Fisk aren't in Turkey at the moment. So I, th- I someone mentioned this on Twitter when I said no sign of them too. They said, oh, maybe they're going to Shelburne. And, well, it turns out, the right, Harry Wood has today joined Shelburne until the end of their season in November on loan, subject to international clearance, of course. But let's have a look at, first of all, our statement and then Shelburne's statement as well. The first player to go to Shelburne. We knew it would happen. We knew it would happen, and it will be interesting to see over the next couple of days what the Shelburne reaction to this is. But let's have a look. It's a the statement reads: Midfielder Harry Wood has joined League of Ireland Premier Division side Premier Division side Shelburne on loan until the 13th of November, subject to international clearance. The 20-year-old, who had his one-year option taken at the end of last season, was a regular for Connor Sellers under-21 side last term, netting a hat-trick away at Charlton Athletic and scoring in the national semi-final against Millwall at the Den. The Leeds born midfielder made his championship debut in the final game of 2022-23, replacing Adama Traore in a goalless draw away at Luton Town. Shelburne, who recently saw our owner Adjun Illagella become a majority shareholder of the club last month, and managed by former Blackburn Rovers, Fulham, Chelsea and Newcastle United midfielder Damien Duff, and are currently sixth in the table after 22 games played. We'd like to wish Harry all the best of luck for his loan spell in Ireland. And now let's read Shelburne's statement, what they say about Harry Wood, what Damien Duff says about Harry Wood and what Harry reckons to join in Shelburne. The statement reads, Shelburne FC is delighted to announce the signing of Harry Wood from Hull City on loan for the remainder of the 2023 season, subject to international clearance. The uh, the central midfielder, the 20-year-old, was born in Leeds and began his football career at Man United's academy. Wood joined Hull's academy as an under-16, making his senior debut in their final game of the 2020-21 season against Charlton Athletic, lifting the League One title. He made his home debut for the club in the Carabao Cup against Wigan in August 2021 before then joining League Two side Scunthorpe on loan. Wood made 13 appearances and registered four assists before returning to the Tigers in January 2022. Wood was then a mainstay in the whole under-21 side last season with notable performances being a hat-trick against Charlton and netting in the national PDL semi-final against Millwall as well as making his EFL Championship debut in Hull City's final game of the season against Luton Town. Damien Duff, Shelburne FC head coach, said, We're very happy to have Harry Wood in the building. He has a high level of technical ability and he will no doubt improve our squad. We were impressed with everything we heard and saw of Harry and we were even more so after training yesterday. He's very honest and hard-working and will fit nicely into our culture. And Harry Wood himself said, I'm delighted to join Shelburne on loan. I can't wait to get playing. As soon as I heard I had the chance to come here, I jumped at it. I'm looking forward to it, working and learning from Damien Duff and his staff. It's an unbelievable opportunity to learn new things and improve my game, especially under the management. Damien and Joey have played at the highest level of football and to work day in, day out under them and the staff is an unbelievable opportunity. The League of Ireland is a competitive league and Shells are a great club with brilliant supporters, so I'm looking forward to putting the red shirt on and doing the best I can. I want to try and help the club get European football, which would be a massive achievement. Harry, go on, Harry. I'm pleased. I'm pleased with that. Um, of all the players that I thought would go out to Shelburne, Harry, now this has happened, makes the most sense. Him, like Matty, Jacob, or Callum Jones, or Jim Sims, would have made the most sense to me because they're on the fringes of that first team. Harry, you know, he, may, he he's liked by Liam Rossini yet. He gave him his debut. He's played so well for the under-21s last season. Every single time I watched the 21s play, Harry in the midfield, be it as a six or as an eight, he was mostly as an eight, he was absolutely incredible. So consistent. So, so consistent. And... I think Shells have got a, they've got a tidy little player on their hands, and I hope that we, he can use this loan spell at Shells to develop, and then he'll come back 
with experience, which is so key for Rossini. He wants young players to go out and get experience. And then he'll come back and hopefully be a little bit closer to the first team, whatever league we may be in next season, be it the Championship or perhaps the Premier League. Let's just slip that in there. Uh, but yeah, I'm I'm, uh, I'm really happy for Harry to have this move. And he, he might get another Harry joining him very soon in Harry Fisk. But we, we will see on that one. I have not heard anything particularly. I did almost buy some tickets for the F1 British Grand Prix of Harry Fisk the, uh, the other week. But um, accommodation and money, really, was the issue. Um, so I thought he'd be selling them because he'd be in Turkey but might he join up with Shelburne don't know let's see thank you for watching everyone and Harry Wood has gone out on loan to Shelburne the first player uh, of ours to go out there and benefit from Ajun owning both clubs <laughs>